from Bataan and Corregidor and from Japanese prisons is General Jonathan M. Wainwright, greeted at San Francisco by the Western Defense Commander and by his sister, Mrs. Frederick Mears. For the first time in five years, Jonathan Wainwright walks on the soil of his native land. Along San Francisco's Market Street, half a million people line the two-mile route of a formal review honoring the last ditch defender of the Philippines and his valiant command. Accompanied by his son, Commander Jonathan Wainwright V, the general saw a cross-section of the power that avenged Baton and Corregidor. Arriving in Washington, he meets Mrs. Wainwright for the first time since she left the Philippines in early 1941. Together again, the general and his wife receive the acclaims of hundreds of thousands on a hero's tour through the nation's capital. Monument, citizens of Washington are masked for civic ceremonies. They await the man who has tasted both the bitterness of defeat and the joy of victory as much as any leader of our time. On the lawn of the White House, General Wainwright receives from the President of the United States the Congressional Medal of Honor for heroic conduct above and beyond the call of duty. 